Hey everyone, welcome back. Hope you all had a great weekend. I thought today in this uh, video for Sunday, we'd get into some vintagey packs, I guess you'd call them. We've got some 91 upper deck there. And I might open these as well, the 89 Tops and 89 Don Russ. Looking for that Ken Griffey Jr. rookie card, hopefully in here. I've only got one pack of those, so I have to have some good luck for that one. I did actually open a pack of these uh, 91 upper deck the other day, and I did get this one, the Luis Gonzalez, Carl Rose, and Jeff Bagwell rookie threats card, which is really cool, I think. That's a great card. And I just love the way upper deck looks. Like it always seems, I don't know, I don't want to say so much better than, you know, Don Russell tops or whatever, but the cards are just so nice. Like the way they look, the photography as well. And then on the back, like you have another photo of the players. You've got the holographic in the top corner as well. The only downside really is the, uh, like players numbers and stats. You only get the last like five years, I think is it, which is, a little annoying, I guess, if you like to read all the stats from the player for their whole career. But you do get these cool holographic cards as well, which I think are pretty cool if you want to collect those type of thing. But without further ado, I'll move those ones out of the way and we'll get into some of these 91 upper deck. It's got find the hank on it. It's the uh, high series one, but they do have, I think they just have a lot of like the low series in anyway, because the, the low series has a uh, Fine and Nolan on the front. So let's see what we can get. And looking for that, is it this Michael Jordan SP card is in this? Which would obviously be lovely to pull. I think there's a Ken Griffey Jr. card in here as well. And there's a giant holographic card. Try and keep my face out of the, uh, out of the holographic. Too early, no one needs to see that. And again, with every baseball card, the only annoying thing is Every baseball card is just switched around. Hey, there's Dante Bichette. That's a cool first card. Lou Brock. I mean, I don't know like too many people from back in the early 90s and stuff. Still learning. So if I do miss anyone, please let me know down below. If anyone of note as well, Glenn Davis. Joe Slaruski. Probably pronounced that totally wrong. Chuck Finley. I think there's a Randy, not Randy Johnson, Frank Thomas, sorry. It's his first upper deck card in this, I think. Mike Heath and Jeff Bagwell had a rookie card in here. Well, there you go. There's another rookie threats card. Second one, that's cool. We'll put that at the back. Keep them ones in view, Brian Smith. Jeff Hamilton. Brian Holman. Steve Farr. Steve Olin. Everyone is going to be upside down, isn't it? Danny Jackson, Pete Smith, and Tom Pagnosi. Get into the next pack. We do have some upper deck 92 as well, I think. Somewhere in here that we'll be getting into at some point. If you want to hit the subscribe notification if that's something you want to see. Texas Rangers holographic. And starting off, we've got Kenny Williams. The only problem with these is just drop them everywhere because they're upside down or back to front. Ron Robinson, M MVP lineup from the Cubbies. Mitch Webster, Mike Bodica. Is that right? Yep, definitely said that right. Oh, we've got to check. BJ Sohoff, Ken Daly. Just taking a million different cars in one go. Dave Smith, Lonnie Smith, Jose Mesa, Bert Subhagen. Did I say that right? Subhagen. I'm just going to butcher so many names, so apologies to everyone. Fred McGriff, that's an awesome car. Put that one on the back. Keep him in view. Eric Anthony. There's Kurt Gibson. It's kind of a weird card, I think. Like, if he's sliding into base or something, or just after he's come up, but you've got the umpire pretty much in the way of the complete, the, the whole photo. There's a cool one on the back. So many mustaches back then. It's great. And Luis Soho. 
I don't know whether to keep the tops eight and nine at the end of the video. I might get into one of them maybe after one more pack of these. Let's see what we've got as a holographic. Hey, another Blue Jade one. I would keep them at the back, but then you would just have to see my face the whole time. Here's a checklist card. Lenny DeCaster and then the Phillies. I'm gonna switch them around. Kenny Rogers. Candy Maldonado. Mark Grace. Dave Parker. Bill Spears. Sean Abner. Luis Salazar. Franklin Stubbs. A great name as well. Steve Fire again. Is that Willie Randolph. Coming upside down. Dennis Brocher. See if I can get these the right way around for the last three cars, I know. Mark Einhorn, Rob Robinson, Ron Robinson again, sorry. And Rich DeLucia. Uh, yeah, I'll do one more pack of the 91 actually, and then we'll get into a top sort of Don Russ. See what we can get from those ones. There's a Bo Jackson on the back. That's a great card. Just the photography in these is so great. We'll put that one out the back as well. Keep a couple for their personal collection. Don Powell. Bill Gullickson. Another Bo Jackson. Terry Kennedy. We've got Eddie Zosky. I wonder if I can just flip some of these around and keep them the right way because this is just getting ridiculous. Jack Clark. Bob Malaki. There's Dante Bichette again. Put that one at the back, actually. And then obviously you've got his son, Bo Bichette, at the moment with the Blue Jays, who are so close. Well, they're in the wild card, actually, I think, at the moment. Ivan Calderon. Scott Sanderson. Mike Calero. Kirk Dressendorfer. Bob Walk. Mike Gardner. Oh, we didn't do the, uh, oh, you've got Seattle Mariners holographic. So, we've got four packs of the 91 upper deck. Let's get into, I think we'll do the 89 tops. I think you've got like a John Schmaltz rookies in these ones. Uh, the Craig Biggio one in here as well. And Randy Johnson. I personally, for the PC, I'd want to get the Craig Vigio rookie and Randy Johnson. And the gum is stuck to the front. Did keep the pack intact there, that's pretty cool. Oh no, I ripped the bottom actually. I don't know. I wonder if I can get the gum off without damaging the card too much. I'm gonna have to take these away. Oh man. Wow, that's really on there, like super glue. No. Well, that bit came off. But this bit, I think, is going to rip the card. And it's gone through anyway, it's like grease from the uh, from the gum. Yeah. Damn, that's annoying. Well, 89 was the last year they put gum in, I think, wasn't it? Sorry. Itchy uh, wrist there. Oh. Andres Galaria, is that right? So yeah, not too bothered about that one being ruined, but still a bit annoying that it's ripped. This is the only pack of 89 tops I've got. Uh, so these are all... Let's flip them around. Hopefully they're all the right way up. Yeah, I think so. So we've got Barry Jones. Herm Winningham. Mark Davidson. Andre Dawson. Doug Jennings. Roberto Alomar. Just a middle card, nothing there. Danny Jackson, Franklin Stubbs, that's a cool card. Camilo Martinez, Blue Jays, that's a really good card. Keep that one for the personal collection. I do like, I do love the Blue Jays. Joey Mayer, Frank Robinson, and Dallas Green. Oh, one more. John Candelaria, excellent. Yes, uh, I think there's a bit of grease on that actually from the uh, gum, which is a bit annoying. There's his stats if anyone wants to read them. 
Not a great pack, not a bad one though. First time opening the 89 top, so not bad. Get back into this 91 upper deck. There's four more packs for this to go. I'm gonna save the Don Rust till the end, I think. And here we got another Mariners holographic card. Nolan Ryan, is it? Not Nolan Ryan, sorry. Vernon Wells, is it? Let me know if I've got that wrong. I think it is. I can't really read that. I'm sure it is, let me check. It'd be really annoying. Well, I don't know if I'm missing something here. Oh, Bobby Thinkpin, is that it? Again, apologies. Like I said, I don't know many players from uh, 91. I was only two years old when these came out. Let's see if I can flip some of these up the right way before we start so we don't have to keep flipping every which way when we get into them. So we've got Gerald Clark, Willie McGee, Jerry Brown, Bob Ojeda, Mark Portugal, John Salu, Salu, Luraski, sorry John, uh, Joe even. I was wrong with my eyes today. Um, man, this upper deck is a nightmare, isn't it? Put these ones up front. We'll get through these ones first because they're the right way. Pat Combs, Mike Schooler, and Sid Breen. Then you've got Milt Thompson. Just and checklist on both sides. Sorry, Mike, I'm going to ruin your second name though. Pagliaro. And Jeff Hamilton. And Francisco Cabrera. So, like I said, I've got, I have got a bunch of, a uh, bunch more vintage packs, I guess. Mostly stuff from maybe early 90s. Oh, Cleveland Indian holographic. Greg Colburn. I've got a couple of Fleer packs. I don't know. I have to do my research more on them before we open them. I don't know if anything is worth, <clears throat> if there's anything of worth in there. In the uh, Fleer, I think we've got Fleer 1990, Fleer 91 and 92. Hey, there's Bobby Vanilla. Still getting paid. And yeah, I've got a uh, 92 upper deck and I've got a couple of packs of... Uh, 93 upper deck as well. So we'll definitely get into those in the next couple of videos. Matt Young, Dion Sanders. And you've got Lewis Mercedes and Bruce Hurst. So the last two packs of 91 upper deck and then we'll do that 89 Dom Russ. Hoping for that Ken Griffey Jr. Or Randy Johnson, actually. I think when you open the 89 John Russ, another M's holographic. So we've got Dave Hansen. I can't remember where I was going with what I was just saying, so hopefully I remember when I pick up the uh, Don Russ pack. Willie Fraser. We've got Reggie Jefferson. Craig Worthington. There's Matt Young. Andy Benz. Another rookie threats card. That's three now. Mike Heath. And MV MVP lineup from the Cubbies, Corey Snyder. And let's see if we can, all of these are the wrong way around. Got Eddie Zosky, Rick Mailer, Mookie Wilson. That, yeah, Tony Fernandez. That's a great card. They're sliding into base photographs, this look awesome. And Danny Jackson. I'm gonna keep that on at the back just because of the way it looks. It's an excellent card. So we've got the last pack of Upper Deck 91. Not really anything, not anything that I wanted to pull for the personal collection. Uh, the Rookie Threat card is actually pretty cool. Fred McGriff, Bo Jackson, the Bobby Bo card's just funny. The Blue Jays leader and Dante Bichette, another M's holographic. Got like four of those now. We've got Lance Dixon. And Mike Walker. Paul Ferris. Ozzy Canseco, Jose Canseco's brother, 
ってるそれ、ブレイディオサーナスアウト、リーディング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、フィッティング、So these are all going to be John Caruti, Mike Stanton, not the Mike Stanton from these days, or John Carlo, as he's called now, Chuck Gary, Chuck Cray, and Candy Maldonado and Brad Ansberg. So yeah, no Ken Griffey in that one, or Luis Gonzalez card. Did get the triple uh, rookie triple threat though, which is pretty cool. And then we have this 89 Don Russ. So, yes, Ken Griffey Jr. rookie card is what I want. I think the Kurt Schilling card is the uh, indicator. So, if you get the Kurt Schilling card, I think there should be a Ken Griffey behind it. But we'll find out. Just like it's such a weird. Card layout, but it does look really cool with the team and like the color. Even though the colors definitely clash completely sometimes with the, either the players or the team's colors. It's Doug Jennings, Mike Smithson. Hey, uh, hour later, that's a great card. I think the purple cards like are definitely the best ones. And then it's a puzzle piece, another one. Mike Campbell, like yeah, the purple borders are definitely uh, the best colorway. If I'm missing anything going through these, like I said, let me know down below. I only have extremely limited knowledge of what I've uh, can remember from these cards and what is worth, and like a million checklists. Doesn't look like there's any Ken Griffey in here. Just the same cards over and over again. Greg Olson, rated rookie card. We'll put that one at the back. Andy Hawkins, Jay Bruner. There's Pete Harris and Mark Lemke. So no Ken Griffey in anything, but not a bad video all in all. Thanks for checking it out, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.